What's going on you guys? I know I lied to you and I said I wasn't going to be having a video for like a week or two. But in my defense I did not lie to you guys. Something happened with our underway schedule and we actually just aren't going out to sea for probably a couple more days and today is Thursday and we have an off day because they have to work on the ship so they let everybody off today so they could work on that ship and fix said part so we can go on said underway but we're supposed to leave on Tuesday it's Thursday now we're probably not gonna leave for a couple more days so I'm gonna do a day of vlogging today just I have an off day, I'm gonna go run out, go get this workout in first thing in the morning, go probably get some food, and just take you guys along with that and show you guys what I'm doing today. I started the morning off by putting some some of this on the carpet, some Glade Hawaiian Breeze, all over the carpet right here, all over, all over here. And uh, what I'm gonna do is let it sit for like five minutes and then I'm gonna vacuum it all up to try to make it smell better in here because it kind of smells like feet in here and I hate that damn smell. As soon as I come in, it's like, it just smell like feet. So that's what I'm gonna do, clean up a little bit, then I'm gonna change, head to the gym um, and just get this day started. It's currently like 8 a.m. and I have the day, so let's go ahead and get that started. All right guys, so I just cooked some breakfast and I have two servings of Kodiak cakes with a serving and a half of chocolate chips in there and I'm gonna put some Walnut Farms on this. This is going to be my pre-workout meal before I go hit chest and tricep. And and then after that, I'm going to shower and then the day is mine. So I'm going to take you guys along with that. Sit back, enjoy. And we're going to get to that in three, two. Nah, I'm not doing that shit. But we're going to get there in a second. What's going on, you guys? Let me drop this down real quick. Hold up. What's going on you guys? So what I'm doing now is I'm about to head to the gym and hit a chest and tricep workout. Um, it's super early still. It's like 9 o'clock. So I'm going to get this done by probably 10, 30, 11. Then the whole day is mine. And we're going to go just, we're just gonna go do some, do, some, do some different activities. Have a little bit of fun. Get a vlog out for you guys. I'm going to edit this and upload it tonight. And then tomorrow, we're not sure about the schedule or anything. So we're going to take you along with that. What's going on you guys? Hold up. What's going on you guys? I just got done with my workout and I'm showered and everything. As you guys seen, I put my weight on here. It said 171, but I'm really about 169 because my camera is about a pound or two. So, um, I'm walking to my car right now. I'm about to go head to my friend's house and then I'm just gonna see. I'm just gonna see where my day takes me. I'm not really sure what's gonna go down yet. I think I had something in mind and I totally forgot what it was. So I'm just gonna probably go hang out with my friend for a little bit, probably get some food too. But I'm just gonna take you guys along with it. Um, and then on a normal off day, or whatever you wanna call it, so catch y'all later. All right guys, so I'm back now. And what I'm having here is just one scoop of protein blended up with some almond milk and some creatine for my post-workout shake. Just one scoop because I'm eating a lot of protein today. I'm just messing around on Logic right now. Um, not really doing anything if y'all want to hear it. Something like it. Russ inspired kind of. And uh, I'm just going to chill right here for a little bit. And then I'm going to head out and go get some groceries and stuff. Probably in the next 20 to 30 minutes. Nothing crazy because we still might leave soon. So that's all I'm doing right now. Still lean bulking. So still got to hit these calories. I'll catch y'all in the next one. All right, you guys, what's going on? I'm about to head out. Um, my building manor came, manager came and knocked on my door and told me I had to go to the main building to update some of my information on my barracks room and everything. So I'm gonna head over there and do that. And I'm gonna try to get like, see if I can get moved to a different barracks. But if I can't, I'm just gonna cool here, kick it back um, and everything. So I'll catch you guys in a little while and uh, we'll just see where the day takes us. What's going on you guys? So I didn't vlog or anything, but I went into Walmart and I picked up three things. I picked up some 90, 96 four lean ground beef, some oatmeal, and some eggs. Mostly just because we're not gonna be here too long. I have rice at the house, so I just needed some lean ground beef to eat for some protein. And then I got some eggs for breakfast tomorrow, along with the oatmeal. And whatever I don't eat on the oatmeal, I'll just bring with me underway and eat it out to see.
What's going on you guys? So I'm back from the store now. Now I'm about to cook up this lean ground beef and some rice. I'll catch you in a little. All right, you guys, so I'm about to cook up this 96 four lean ground beef and then two packs of this basmati rice, and that's what I'm gonna eat. But I'm starving right now, so while I cook this, I'm going to eat some oven baked flaming hot Cheetos. The macros on these aren't too bad for the whole bag is 16 grams of fat, 60 carbs, 6 protein, and 400 calories. Might just eat half the bag or might just end up eating the whole thing. Who knows? Cook up this lean ground beef though and everything, and I'll see you guys when that's all done. I just wanted to check up. All right, you guys, so I just cooked this up, and right here I have a packet of Uncle Ben's Ready Rice on each plate, so two packets in total. I just threw some ground beef on top of each one. This one has almost a serving of fat-free mozzarella. There's the rest of the pack, and this one has a little over a serving, so kind of evens itself out with some butter spray on there. So all in all, it's about, so two packs of Uncle Ben's Ready Rice, probably anywhere from eight ounces of ground, lean ground beef and then some fat free mozzarella with some butter spray i'm gonna kill this this has been a staple all the time if you're trying to build muscle and get bigger so this is what i'm gonna do now sit here and watch some youtube videos and i'll catch you guys later all right you guys so i'm heading out now to the chinese buffet we're gonna go eat with a couple of my friends and everything so i'll catch you guys when we get there i'm probably just gonna record on my iphone for that because i don't want to carry my dslr into the restaurant but i'll see you guys when we get there you ready you ready all right what's going on you guys we're back from getting sushi and eating at the chinese buffet and everything and this is going to be the end of the night i'm about to sit down and record um uh, a commentary for my workout that I recorded because I didn't want to put it at the beginning of the workout because people might not be interested So this is going to be the end of the video stick around for the commentary on the pull uh, Nope on the push workout that I did the chest and triceps with a little bit of shoulders Enjoy that I'm gonna talk a little bit through that if you guys want to hear anything But that's all I'm gonna do for this so like comment share subscribe and enjoy the rest I'll catch you guys in the next one What's going on, you guys? Welcome to the commentary. This is my first time ever doing a commentary, so you guys might just have to bear with me on this one. I'm going to be talking for a little while, so it's just going to be me and the microphone for a little. And uh, First thing I started with right here, as you guys can see, was 225. I repped this out for three reps. I would have went for more, but my shoulders were a little tight still, so I didn't want to injure them. Nice thing, I hopped over here to 205, and I repped this for six reps. This is a plate and a 35. Um, after I did this, I went ahead and broke it down to five reps, and then from five reps, I did four reps then I dropped it down to 185 which is a 25 on each side I did that for like I think five or six then took it all off all the way to the bar immediately and did it for like 10 my shoulders were kind of aching a little bit so I didn't do too much more next thing you see here I did a pyramid set with the incline barbell and I went from a plate added a 10 did that for a failure added another 10 for failure and you're seeing the top set right here of uh, five tens on there and I did this for like five or six reps and then immediately what I would do is just immediately as soon as i rack it as you see i hop up i take off a 10 hop back down rep it out again as soon as i can't do any more put it back up take off a 10 do it again all the way down so that's a pyramid scheme um it's kind of good just to keep up the intensity and keep the heart rate going up as well keep that muscle under a lot of tension for a strict amount of time and uh now that i have a little bit of clip here to talk a little bit um we actually did get delayed on our underway schedule so that's why i'm uploading this video i'm still, still trying to get contact out even though we might leave any day now we have no idea we just have to wait and see it's kind of just a waiting game and uh everything so that's what we're doing there so just to give you guys a little bit of an update on that we're just literally just waiting for for the green light or the red light and uh I'm going to try to get another video up tomorrow if we don't leave then. Whenever we leave, I have no idea. And uh, even if I knew, I really couldn't put it online. So next thing I'm doing right here is a fly. Um, I'm doing the fly on the machine right here. And I think I did anywhere. I think I did five sets of anywhere from 10 to 12. Um, what you want to do, focus on here, is retracting your scapula, really rolling those shoulder blades back, sitting into the bench, and pushing your chest out so you can get the most contraction in your chest because this will this will actually work out a lot of uh, your front delt if you allow it to. So just try to pinch those shoulder blades back and really squeeze in your chest when you go ahead and act like you're trying to hug a tree or something. Um, so next thing I did here was a superset. I went ahead and did... Um, a cable push down as you can see a tricep push down uh, i think i did 10 to 12 reps here really uh 
just kind of going fast. It kind of looks and look cheaty, but I try to do it a little. Um, all the way to just a straight face pull, anywhere from 10, 12 reps automatically. Next thing we're doing is a single arm overhead uh, like extension. I usually do this um, with like the, the V the V rope um, and do both at a time, but I really wanted to do a single arm, a lot of single arm movements today. So I went ahead and did single arm movements so I can get a better contraction and feel it a little bit better. And then ultimately after here, I just went ahead and picked up, I had 15 pound dumbbells and I went ahead and did some lateral raises, I think 10 to 12 reps or something like that, just automatically. I've been really uh, enjoying supersets lately to keep the heart rate up and really shorten my time in the gym, just try to get them done as quick as possible. Next thing I've seen doing here is something I've seen on Steve Cook's chest workout. You get a dumbbell, just put both arms on the bar, squeeze it and really push it up. This is my top set with a hundred pound dumbbell. And I think I did it like six, six set, six reps and then just kept going down increasingly next thing i did was some dips as you can see what i do is just focus on here is just trying to hit that parallel 90 degrees don't want to go too low to get too much shoulder um in in it and this was my last set of four um four sets of about 12 then i went ahead and did this decline hammer strength uh, machine um i think i did four sets of anywhere from eight to 12 with just a plate in the 35 just to just get that that decline motion kind of in there still next thing i did here was a reverse um tricep push down single arm again um I, i've been really enjoying single arm movements uh just to kind of mind muscle connection focus on that muscle a little bit better and everything and then ultimately i just jumped in straight here to hanging leg raises and i'm sorry about this angle the angle really wasn't too good it was kind of crowded there, as you can see the people in the background so i was really just trying to to push through it and get it done um and still get a video for you guys and then i finished off with some abs right here i did some leg raises and what you want to focus on here is just pulling your legs up and then shooting them to the sky but really feeling it in your abdominal um these literally fried my abs after my workout so you lift up your legs push them straight to the sky kind of let them go down a little slow and for here i did about four sets of i think 12 to 15 the first set might have been 15 the next three sets might have been 12 but that was pretty much the whole workout um nothing too crazy just trying to get that that's still going in there and uh i want to thank you guys so much for watching the video i hope you enjoyed you guys can go ahead and try this workout um and tell me what you think about it i've just been piecing these workouts together really and uh i hope you guys enjoy the video and i will see you in the next one